Right, it is 22 and a half minutes away from seven. Let's talk money with AMP now. And Tony's here with some changes, Tony, in the rules for getting your money out of a term deposit. This is quite important because people may have term deposits and not know this. That's right. Look, and we have a lot of money invested in New Zealand in term deposits around $127 billion worth. Now, this is a change that's come in. Um, and it's affecting people who are investing money in term deposits anywhere from a few months to a few years. Up to now, people have always been able to break the term deposit if they needed the money early, minus a little bit of the interest. But there's been this change in the rules and it involves the big four Australian banks. People will now have to wait around 31 days to get their money unless they can prove financial hardship. Now ANZ, BNZ and Westpac have already adopted the rules and ASB says it will do so in June. Now, the rule change was imposed by the Australian regulators as part of moves by the Australians aimed at making sure their banking system is stable and can withstand future financial shocks. A lot of people are affected by this. The big four Australian banks probably have around 80% of the local New Zealand banking market. So it really means that if you've got a term deposit or you're thinking about a term deposit, you really need to think carefully about when you might need your money. Well, which I mean is obvious, and obviously you should always do that. And everyone accepts that there should be a penalty for pulling it out early, because the whole point of a term deposit is you've agreed to keep it in for that amount of time, and so you've got a special interest rate. That's fine. But to not let people get their money out... And what I find interesting about this is not actually a rule that's been imposed by the New Zealand Reserve Bank. It's actually something that the big four Aussie banks have to do because their parent banks in Australia have been compelled to well, do I'm this. Sure you can negotiate your way out of this. It's just a matter of talking to your personal banker or your bank manager when it comes time to renew your term deposit. Well, it's also a reminder, picking up on what we talked about last week with TDs, but also mortgages. You know, Always haggle, always yep. talk to the banks and say, well, look, actually, I've shopped around a few of the New Zealand-owned banks, and here's what they're offering yep, me. Absolutely. It's your money, for God's sake. It's your money. They get 31 days before you can get it out. Bastards. All right, Tony, thank you very much for that. You see, we're keeping an eye on these people so you don't have to.